Okay, guys, we're doing Octopus's Garden by the Beatles. We're going to just be playing some chords and strumming and singing to it. Uh, here we go. Let me do a little bit for you. I like to be under the sea in an octopus's garden in the shade. He let us in. His octopus is garden in the shade. Okay, so let's try that. Much, it's not a really difficult song. Um, <clears throat> just, you know, besides the chord changes. Um, we're going to be doing some open string chords here. And uh, you might want to check out our website, Mike's Guitar Lessons. Dot com. A lot of stuff on there that we don't put on YouTube, but uh, we keep all the good stuff on there. <laughs> really uh, will uh, advance you as a guitar player and get you where you want to be, you know, and, and as far as uh, being a complete player. So uh, here's the part one for free for you, though, on YouTube. Um, we're going to start with an E major chord, okay? Uh, if you don't know any of these chords, check out our chord uh, videos. We show you how to play each chord in each video so that you can just look up the chord that you're looking for and you can learn how to do it and then come back here and plug them in. Uh, so I'm not going to take the time to show you the chord, how to do it here, but uh, we, we, we will work on the strumming and the singing. We're going to start with an E chord and uh, we're just going to thumb through them as we sing the lyric like this. I'd like to be... And we're going to go to a C sharp minor. Okay, but let's do that first chord again. We're going to strum it and then start singing. I'd like to be... We're going to go to C sharp minor. Now C sharp minor is a bar chord, okay? And don't be afraid of bar chords. Just get in there and start trying them, and uh, you'll get them down eventually. Even if all the notes don't come out, as long as some of them come out, it'll sound fine. Okay? And then eventually your hand will figure it out, and you'll be able to get all of them to come out. So C sharp minor is on the fourth fret. An A minor form there, so C sharp minor here. You, you strum it and then sing under the C. Okay, so let's start over and do what we have so far. I'd like to be C sharp minor under the C in an octopus's. Now, when we sing octopuses, we want to do an A chord, so that's an A open string chord. Uh, you may play your A chord like this or just like this. However you do it is fine, as long as it's an A chord. In an octopus's garden, in the shade. Now when you do shade, we want to do a B7, okay? So there's your B7, using all four fingers. Um, in the shade. Strum it twice. So let's start over and, and uh, go that far. Here we go, starting with the E chord. Ready, go. I'd like to be under the sea in an octopus's garden in the shade and then we go uh, back to an E chord and we're going to do pretty much the same chords but different lyrics here we go he let us in in C sharp minor knows where we've been in his octopus's garden there's the A chord in the shade so it's the same little chord progression two times in a row with different words, okay? So now, let's look at how we might strum this, all right? Uh, something like... So just sort of a down, 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 up, down, up, okay? The first two downs are long, so we have down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, then the C-sharp minor, down, 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 up, down, up. In an octopus's garden. All right, I'm going to go through it at a slow tempo, singing it and strumming it so you can see how it will go together so that you can do it yourself. All right, here we go. Ready, go. I'd like to be He let us in Knows where we've been In his octopus's garden 
garden in the shade. Okay, so here's the part one. We'll finish the song in part two.